I'm a Morehouse chemistry major and an education studies major at Spelman College also. Um, met Mr. Golfin yes. yesterday, yes, yesterday and his son. Um, very impressed by the demonstration of um, his son's knowledge of organic chemistry. Having taken the course in the past year, um, understanding how in-depth one's understanding has to be in order to construct sound, um, um, sound structures, um, making sure that formal charges are accounted for, um, multiple naming conventions with the IUPAC naming convention. It was an awesome experience. Um, and I, I run into Mr. Golfin today and my, my biggest question is how do, how, how do we, um, can, how do we teach a child that young, um, beyond memorization, how to, um, how to do physical, I mean, do organic chemistry, period. I mean, just learning some of the basic principles, like formal charge and um, understanding the, the natures of covalent and ionic bonds is um, a concept that a lot of students in the college cor course room, they have problems with. And he demonstrated efficiency, obviously mastery of those concepts in drawing of structures. Blown away. Um, my my, and I have to know how do we get, how do we bring that kind of development um, out of ch children that young, so that when they do reach, um, when they do reach college, that they're able to grasp um, the higher level courses with ease, like the physical chemistries, the ones that, that that students are, you know, that are like hazing courses for chemistry work. Because we're, we're, we're good at the organic, we're great at the, the inorganic and the elementary, but the concepts supersede the things that we're used to um, in those higher level courses. But if we had experience at a young age with the organic chemistries and with the, the, the more detailed sciences, I think that, that would that would breed a, a generation of super scientists, people who can who are able to make the advances and in, 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 in the more and uh, in, in, in the things that are troubling our, our society, like what science is for, the technology that comes from it, the, the cancer development, the research. It's, it's just awesome to, to think about a student like that and what he would be capable of doing 20 years from now when he's actually had <laughs> time to be exposed. This is just amazing. Uh, I, just, I just want to thank you, Mr. Mr. Golfer, for that experience. And, uh,